what do you guys as, as players make of his antics out there when he gets on on his knees and slaps the floor as he's getting ready to pick up a guard in the backcourt? It's a little bit much. I'm not going to lie to you. <laughs> it's a little Better. bit much. If he's doing it to your team, and you know it as well as I do, because we both played against guys that do those kind of things, it, it irritates you. There's no question about it, particularly – if it's directed at you personally, there's no question about it. But, I, you know, I agree with some of the things that Chris said. I think Kevin Garnett is very selective about who he does that to. But having said all of that, Kevin Garnett is a guy that relies on emotion. And his emotion has changed the culture of the Boston Celtics in one season in terms of how intense they are on the defensive end of the floor. So it's something that gets him going. It got him a world championship, but it's no doubt it irritates you as an opposing player. Win, lose, or draw, nobody wants to be embarrassed. Your team can beat me. You could possibly have a great game. But once you try to show me up, then it becomes personal. And this up to the officials, to be honest, to police it. Other than that, Players on the floor should police it. As you've seen Jaja Pachulia get up in KG's face. As you've seen Jose Calderon look for the ref and say, are you yeah. going to give this guy a tech? Are you going to help me out? Because next time if he drives to the basket and I take him out, don't eject me or give me a technical foul when right. he really You saw what just it. happened. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah, I, was, I, I, I would love to know what he said to Calderon because in that particular instance, Calderon kept looking at the official as if to say, are you listening to this? You know, Are you going to do something about this? Obviously, he did not.